guys, it's Jen, and I have another tutorial for you today. It's actually a nail tutorial. Um, I've been loving these lately. <laughs> but this one um, specifically is inspired by these little strawberry-filled candies. I don't really know what to name it, but I definitely know this is great for the springtime, great if you're looking for something a little fun, and you're looking for something simple. I know that nail tutorials especially can be very discouraging because they always look so difficult, but in my personal opinion, this is actually pretty simple, and my nails aren't even, I mean, they're a little long, but they're not that long, so you could definitely rock this on short nails as well. If you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns about anything that I used in this video, you can go ahead and drop me a comment as always. I'll get back to you, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Alright, bye guys. So I'm going to first start off um, saying I'm sorry for the raspy voice. I actually think I may have the flu, but nevertheless, show may go on. Um, so I hope you guys can just bear with that. I'm going to show you what you're going to need for this manicure. Um, it's pretty simple. You're just going to need a fine nail art brush, nail um, dotting tool. These both can be found on eBay. Um, something you're going to want to be able to dip your nail polishes on. This is like the smallest, and this is actually a Slim Jim lid. So white or white, yellow nail polish color, sparkly red, uh, clear coat, green color, and a nice like ruby red. All the names to the products will be listed down below so you can go ahead and check them out. Um, and I always advise using a paper towel so you know in case you make a mess, you'll be alright. So I've started this off by um, using a red base for my strawberry nails. So for this nail right here, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to slap on some glitter just to kind of have this as my accent nail. Um, it'll be the same thing on the other hand as well. While that nail is drying, we're going to go ahead and we're going to start off with our seeds using this yellow color. I'm going to put a little bit on my Slim Jim lid. Don't laugh, guys. And basically what you're going to do, um, I'm going to show you on one nail real quick. You're going to grab a little bit on the end there, obviously, and you're just going to do little seeds like that. Like a dot, but you're going to drag down. So this is what the nails should look like um, for the yellow dots and now you're ready to go ahead and do the dots on the uh, glittery nail as well. So after we've let our little beautiful um, polka dots dry, we're going to go ahead and take our green. This is probably like the most complicated out of the tutorial but it really shouldn't be too hard. Uh, it might take practice but we're going to be using our, um, oh come here buddy, this little guy right here to paint our design. First recommendation I do have though is to not get a lot and then we're going to kind of like tip the end there. Like we're going to do a thin layer first and this is going to be the little, uh, what is it called, the stem or whatever. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of just like tip the nails, you know, I don't know how, how do you say that guys, uh, line them, I don't know, whatever. We're going to do this first. I'm going to dip some of my green nail color onto my, oh my god, that was way too much, my uh, thing here, and then dip my brush into it. So uh, we are going to create a flame-like design at the tip of our nails for all the nails, and this is going to act as our leaves for our strawberries. Um, I apologize that you can't really see the details too well on how I'm doing it, but I, believe me, it's pretty simple, and in just a second, you'll see what they will look like. So this is what your little nail design should look like um, when you're done. Yeah, so basically at the end it's just like little flames even though it's supposed to be little leaves and branches. After that, we're going to slap on the clear coat. So now we're going to apply that clear coat and we're just going to make sure everything is dry. Um, the one thing with nail art design is if you, you know, put your clear coat on while your stuff is still wet, it's going to bleed and screw up your design. So line the edges of your nails too. So that's it. That completes our nail tutorial. I hope you guys enjoy. It's a pretty easy, um, simple tutorial. It looks cute. It's great for spring. And uh, yeah, so go ahead and let me know what you guys think. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.